Hello everybody, Miss Hutchinson here. We're going to do another active listening story lab today, and this time I'm going to be reading Pete the Cat, Robo Pete. That's written by James Dean. So while I'm reading today, think in your brains about what did you like. Remember the boy and the girl here reading a story about cats. They're thinking about their favorite parts. The girl's favorite part is when the cat is chasing the ball. The boy's favorite part is when the cat is sleeping. So, boys and girls, let's go ahead and begin reading. All right, here we go. Pete the Cat, Robo Pete. What a great sunny morning. Pete can't wait to play baseball with his friends. Do you want to play catch? Pete asks Larry. I can't, says Larry. I'm going to the library. Do you want to play catch? Pete asks Callie. I was about to go for a bike ride, says Callie. Do you want to play catch? Pete asks John. I can't right now, says John. I have to paint the fence. Pete wishes his friends would do what he wants to do. It's no fun playing catch all by himself. If only I knew another me, Pete thinks. And like that, Pete had a great idea. Pete builds a robot. He programs it to be just like him. Welcome to the world, Robo Pete, Pete asks says to the robot, you're my new best friend. We'll do everything together. And I want to play catch, says Pete. Great idea, says Robo Pete. Pete and Robo Pete play catch. Wow, says Pete, running after the ball. You sure can throw far. Robo Pete throws farther and farther until time out, says Pete as he tries to catch his breath. <gasps> Let's play something else. I want to play whatever you want to play, says Robo Pete. How about hide and seek, says Pete. That will be fun, says Robo Pete. Pete finds the best hiding place ever. He's sure Robo Pete will never find him. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, shouts Robo Pete. Ready or not, here I come. He's hiding in a chicken. Gotcha, shouts Robo Pete, tagging Pete. Hey, how did you find me, says Pete. With my homing device, says Robo Pete. I can find anyone, anywhere. Okay, enough hide and seek, Pete says. Let's play some guitar. Pete teaches Robo Pete how to play a song he made up. You have to feel the music, Pete explains. Okay, says Robo Pete. To feel it, I need to play loud, explains Robo Pete. Pete tries to stop Robo Pete, but Robo Pete can't hear him over the noise. This is fun, says Robo Pete. This is awful, says Pete the cat. Okay, says Pete Robo Pete. Let's ride our skateboards instead. Before Pete can answer, Robo Pete's feet transform into a motorized skateboard with super speedy wheels. Let's go, Pete. Robo Pete shouts. Wait, says Pete. Pete chases after Robo Pete. He has no idea where Robo Pete is going. Robo Pete crashes into the sandbox at the playground. Are you okay? Pete asks his robot. I am a robot. I am indestructible, says Robo Pete. What is this strange place? It's a playground, says Pete. He waves to his friends. This is Robo Pete, Pete says to Callie, Larry, and John. I made him myself. Cool, says Larry. We are going to help finish John finish painting, says Callie, and then we're going bike riding. I want to go on the slide, says Robo Pete. Robo Pete, I want to help my friends paint the fence, Pete tells his robot. Paint the fence? That would be great, Robo Pete says. I am programmed to paint faster than anyone. Pete and his friends try to help, but Robo Pete paints too fast. So instead they ride bikes and they read books. And after Robo Pete is done painting, they help him clean the brushes. Pete realizes that it doesn't matter what they do. 
just being with his friends, it was what makes it real fun. The end. So, boys and girls, think about what you liked best in this story. Pete the cat, he just wanted to play games and he learned. It doesn't matter what they do. As long as he's with his friends, he can have fun in the end, right? So think, what did you like best? Tell somebody at your home and then have them send me a message so I can know what you like best too. All right, well, have a good day and I will see you soon. Goodbye.